The first thing we're going to do is create a better storage system. And just like that, we have everything sorted in chests. And now we can do bigger and more things more organized and hey faster. Hey guys, welcome back. And I know that that was a weird intro, but I hope that y'all do enjoy these videos. And thank you for all the support. Because I do spend hours on these videos. And I spend a lot of time on them, you know what I'm saying? So I hope that y'all do enjoy. Make sure to hit that like button, subscribe if you're new. And let's get on to the video because it gets crazy. Alright guys, now that we're in the nether, we have to go find a fortress to get a whole bunch of blaze rods. Alright guys, this right here, this tunnel that you see right in front of me is the place that leads to the nether fortress. Now it does have a turn because what I did was I found it, got the coordinates, and then made a tunnel to it. Let me just say this took me a long time, so I'll do a time lapse of me running towards it or to the fortress. Guys, I didn't even see this ancient debris, and I fixed the ladders. I had to go all the way back and then fix the ladders and had to do stuff. But this is the fortress. Um, It doesn't exactly look connected all the way, but I guess I'll fill in all these gaps right here, and I'll find the blaze spawner so we can get infinite blaze rods. Alright, so what I did was, this is our entrance right here, and I just put, um, like, covered in the pathways on the other places, and that is our blaze rods. Um, I might just leave the, um, the stuff that's in the ground, or on the walls, um, right here, the roofs and stuff, just because it makes it look more natural. I have a, like, plan for this, Oh, I have a plan for this fortress later, but I will, I will be right back when I have 64 blaze rods. I'll do a time lapse of me killing the, uh, the 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 blazes Alright guys, I got exactly 64 blaze rods. It definitely is a little bit overkill, but let's start heading back to the overworld. Before I do anything else, let's check the iron farm. Alright, it's been doing pretty good. I haven't been on the world in um, that long, or at least in this area, so it does pretty good. The one thing that I want to do is repair my shield. Well, not repair, get a new shield and keep this one just because why not? I mainly want to keep it because it's my first shield in this world and it would be very, you know, unique. Well, we need some wood to do that. And boom! A new shield because those blazes really took a big dole out of my shield. Put this in there and let's keep it for safekeeping. Let's put it right here. Now the next thing I need is to get a clinic villager so I can get infinite ender pearls because that's the second material you need to kill the ender dragon. Which I may or may not be doing this episode. And to do that, I need the brewing stand. And by the way, I am 100% killing the Ender Dragon and getting the Elytra today. But you might be wondering, aren't you going to lose ideas to do in this world? Well, absolutely not. I have so many plans, and they're just going to take me a long time to do. And when I say a long time, I mean like a week or two for each video. Maybe even longer if I really want to go all out. Now apparently if I level up this clinic all the way to max level that he will give me the ender pearls. So I'll be back when I can get the ender pearls. I got the ender pearl trade and looky there it's 5 emeralds per ender pearl. So if we want 10 ender pearls we're going to have to get 50 emeralds which is going to take a while. So I'll be right back when I mine a whole bunch of trees and I get the said emeralds. But let me go to sleep real quick. The emeralds and it only took me like 3 of those jungle wood but let's see if we can get all 10 of these. We actually did. We got all 10 which is actually kind of crazy. We're level 31 and let's just turn these into eyes of ender. And now we have 10 Eyes of Ender, which means that it can lead us to the Ender Dragon. Now before we defeat the Ender Dragon, let's get the tools so we can actually do it right. 
I think we got plenty of arrows. Breaking three on our bow. It has flame one, power three, and punch one. That's really good in my opinion. And it doesn't really matter about infinity because we all know that I have infinite arrows. Now guys, all I needed was this cobblestone and I think I have plenty of that. So let's go find this portal so I can defeat the ender dragon. It looks like it's going this way, so I'm going to go travel in this direction. Alright, let's throw another Eyes of Vendor, and it looks like it changed direction to over here, so I'll just go straight until I see like a village or something, because I'm pretty sure that's where they spawn. Wow, and you see that? There's a village. I'm pretty sure if you ring like the bell, and it and, like has these little sparkles, and that means there's a stronghold underneath it, so let me just go find that bell and ring it. I'm just going to throw this and see where it leads. It leads in this direction, so I'm going to go this way. Oh, it leads this direction too, so I guess in Bedrock it doesn't go down because I threw a second one and it landed this way. So it has to be underneath here. We just landed it in a mine shaft. I'm just going to keep going down just in case. I just found the strong code and this is where it led me so I'm just going to find the portal real quick or I should say the portal room and I'll be right back. Guys in this chest right here there was diamonds, bread and gold and I turned the corner right here and as you can see there is a portal room right here and we have the exact amount of eyes for this end portal. I am so dumb. We need three more. I didn't bring them with me. Uh, I guess I'll be right back. I'm going to go to my house and I'm going to bring two, three more ender thing, majigger things, things. One, two, three. Let's go to the end, guys. Let's jump in. Oh, I forgot to do this. I forgot to. Okay, there we go. There we go. Why? Where is it? Is it? Bruh, it's literally right there. Are you serious? I have to bridge to it. This is probably one of the worst spawns you can get. It hopefully it doesn't knock me off. Why am I so bad at this game? LMG water bucket right there. I was wrong guys, I need to get rid of like a couple more and then I think I could defeat him. That was so loud guys, that was so loud. Like, that was cr incredibly loud. Might have to turn that up for you guys by a lot. Because that was crazy loud, guys. Like, literally, guys, I'm gonna have to bring down... Like, literally, guys, I'm gonna have to pull down my headphones when I try to kill him. That's how loud he is. He literally... He literally sounds like he's breaking my headphones. I'm gonna have to turn that down by a lot. And guys, there we go. We killed the Ender Dragon. It wasn't that difficult. Probably took me like 10 minutes. You might be asking me, wait, is that all we're gonna do this episode? Is that the end? Are we done with this episode? Well, no. Now, we're gonna go get an Elytra. And just like that, we have the portal that will take us to the location to the Elytra. But this is really far out. Is this just me or is this really far out? Let's just throw the ender portal in there. There we go. We are here and now we just got to do a whole bunch of walking and building. And then I'll, I'll catch up with you guys when I find the uh, Elytra. I'm mid-air flying over here. Uh, let's just go inside of here. Let's grab you get all the instant health and let's come down here kill you Oh, yeah, you are hurt. See what's inside these chests. Ooh, a lot of pickaxes, which is pretty cool They're not diamond uh, fortune three on that one a shovel and a iron helmet But the most thing that we came here for was the elytra. I'll take this, you know, I'll take this too and this one thing that I do want to grab is going to be the head right here. So let's see if we can grab this. 
We grabbed it. Now I'm just gonna I'll meet back up with you guys when I get back home. Or no, I'll meet I'll meet back up with you guys when I get back to the portal because I need to get the dragon egg. I collected some more XP, that's how I got my stuff level up if, the, if you want to know because I don't you know. But let's just click this right here and it says it send it over here and then I can just bang boom one more block bang boom and now we have the head of the dragon the egg of the dragon and the elytra and we have a whole bunch more stuff inside of here which is pretty cool let me just go back through this portal and i should be home oh there's the minecraft stuff let me just skip that and we made it back home which is a pleasant present thing to see i really in like my home base but yeah guys um that might be it for the episode i'm about to decorate this let me jump up and down and it should be all decorated boom look guys i have my elytra on i have this stuff right here it's gonna it's gonna look better in the future okay I'll, I'll i'll make it look a lot better but now we have the elytra i'll put on breaking and mending on and off camera and i really do need to get sharpness on the sword because it is really bad like insanely bad and i will do all this sorting and stuff off camera as well and create all the shulker boxes i can but guys i hope that y'all did enjoy this video i did a lot today i explored a lot i did a lot so if you guys enjoy make sure to hit that like button subscribe if you're new and hit the notification bell for more videos because it does take me a long time to do this and yeah that's basically all i got for you today let me just play Oh, 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 hang on. Give me a second. Give me a second. Let me boom. Boom. And if I go inside of here and I collect you and I collect you, put you right there. Bam. Boom. All right, guys. I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.